What's going on guys? It's Nark. Welcome along to episode number two of Tartarus. And uh, we're on our way to Trauma. Oh, it's Mitch's carriage, look. And Trauma was locked. But um, yeah, there was there was nothing for us there. There's pizza. I still find it fascinating. That I like fast food in space. So yeah, we're headed to Trauma. I did forget to record, so that bit is slightly cut off from the YouTube recording. I do apologize. Um, but yeah, Mitch isn't around. Mitch isn't around in Mitch's garage, so... Maybe we... Just simply need to head back to Trauma now that we've found out that he's not here. Maybe something else will happen. Now we've done that, I, I don't know. Andrew's still not on comms. Nope. Oh, fucking believable. Can anything be easy on this goddamn ship? Clearly not. Want another route. So yeah, it's coming from over there, so I kind of my hunch was before as well, before I'd even been back to Mitch's garage. Probably had to go through that little hatch that we came across before. Um, where's that door going? That door just penetrates the ceiling. I think this wall needed to be thicker. Thicker. Wow. Jeez. Anyway, moving swiftly on. Yeah, this is the route I'm going to take. I think this is like the air shaft that we originally came in, right? All right, seems like we've um, had some long four boots from Aperture. So we can only go this way. Do you know what? I honestly thought that was just like a video screen or something. Then I kind of looks a bit unnatural. I don't know why. Keep going straight down here. Honestly, I hope I don't have to go back because I have no idea how to get back at all. Which isn't good. Well, I've been down here before. 
I remember that area. Let's head. That's where I came from, right? Is there anything down here? It's a way around. We'll go this way. Telling me to go up. But there is no way for me to press to go up. Okay. This is just going to be my life now. We're just going to be like roaming around the freaking sewers. Like lost. This is our life. So we came from the right there where I've just been passed. This might just lead back to that rec room that we was in before, but maybe something has changed. I, I don't know. Also, did we just like? Mm. Also, what the hell is going on with these doors? Is that like a... What is all this green stuff? I think it's like growing green. I don't know if it's just like from the game. Maybe it's like the reflection off here, but... Okay, so Oh, I think it's just like a it's just like a flap, I think. Okay. There is just some really weird green lighting all around here for some reason. So that end's blocked off with boxes, right? Didn't miss any ways to the left or right here, did I? There's no way that I can get past them. Okay. There was nothing down to the right here. Either. So. We'll go straight back. On this magical mystery tour.
I don't know how it's casting a shadow like that though. I mean, it's just like, it's not even bright enough. Not that way. Just let me, um, there might be a few of those popping up. Let me, I can't, don't matter. Let's crack on. So, it doesn't look like we can get around this way. There is no other way to go through this duct. So did I miss something down in the garage here? There's uh, some sort of floor panel or like side panel or something. Doesn't seem like it. Hmm. Where am I meant to be going? Can I just pick up? Wow, look at this plant. So beautiful, so delicate. So in my fucking way. Really? Wow game. <sighs> Hello, Dodge. Wandering around in the dark. That's all I seem to do anymore. Why do we have to turn off like the flashlight every time? What's going on, Conklan? This is, if you're referring to the game, this is Tartarus. This has been in, I've had this in my library for freaking 
a long ass time. And it's meant to be a puzzle game. Um, but it's really, really cryptic. When I asked LB if LB would recommend it, he just sort of rolled his eyes at me. Come on, Mitch. Wake up. Wake up, man. God damn it. Uh, I've been streaming on Mixer for quite a while now, actually, Conklin. I've just basically moved over to Mixer um, uh, just for various reasons. Almost starting afresh, building a bit of a new community on Mixer in a fashion. Can I take the keys? No. I guess not. I guess not. Um, all right, so. Hey, Andrews, you there? Answer me, you goddamn bastard. I know you're there. Yeah, I can hear you, Coop. We should get to the trauma center. I've tried to open the door for you, but the damn terminal isn't giving me any feedback. No, no, no. The door's still locked tight. Oh, yeah. come <laughs> Cheers, Conklin. Important. Find the others. We need to keep. I never said I didn't find. Them. What did you say? <laughs> I'm just joking, man. Feels like we're playing hide and seek out here. I'll keep looking. I had an idea for getting us out. Hmm. So, this I've got to do. Come, get to the upper deck and find the old navcom room. There are tons of old instruments that we could use to make a distress call to any nearby ships. Fine. Me and Mitch will have to wait, right? They're not going anywhere. I'll contact you when I'm there. I'm putting my trust in you, Q. Bad choice. Um, by default, Conklin, there's um, there is um a lot of nice things built into Mixer, so you can build your own kind of like um interactive boards and stuff. So let me just turn one on really quickly. Let me turn on. Just the board that I've got. So yeah. Um, so you can basically just straight off the bat you set up all these buttons and stuff and it will do different bits of pieces. So there you go, you just use the high button for instance. Um, and yeah, there's a kind of a uh, side app called Firebot which you can basically, you can um, basically uh, set all up your on-screen actions, your sound effects, different bits and pieces. So kind of like what I've always wanted to do with the um, the bot when I used to do the bot on Twitch um, is pretty much available for me here right off the bat. So that's one of them. And then I really like the like the faster than light um, protocol the mixer has. So um, yeah, the, like, the, the delay between like you typing something and then me seeing it and then me responding to that literally is normally within like one or two seconds. It's, it's really, really good. Um, so yeah, a couple of reasons why I switched over. Um, still kind of like you know, testing the waters and stuff. All right, so where have I got to go? Go to the upper deck. I'll go that way though. So what is Andrew's plan? Are we actually like against Andrew's here? He kind of seems a bit shady. That door's clearly we're going to get a pass. I bet he's behind that freaking door. Just like uh, I am using B mod. Um, I don't know if I'm using your B mod items, Conclan. Uh, but after like doing the map earlier on, uh, and making changes, I realised um, the thing I commented on on your plants for hire map about the triggers um, is, a, is a byproduct of you. I guess you use that kind of extended range button with the extended triggers. Um, so I've I've used it on mine as well. So I think I commented at the time. This, Yeah, the trigger buttons. 
This is a good one. Look, I noticed this earlier on. LB would be all over this. Look, look. Solid wall. Solid wall. Door goes through solid wall. It's great. Yeah, they are really good for cube swapping, especially when you're like using a funnel and stuff. Um, it's really, really helpful. Where are we going? Upper deck. That's where I'm going. Up deck. Uh, is that back where I came from originally? Where my first puzzle was? Possibly. Um, it's the bridge, I mean. Maybe not. I can't use any of these other computers, can I? Hmm. Maybe there is somewhere else I need to be. I'm sure if I needed to be back at the bridge, it would have said bridge, not upper deck. So the only way I could think then is this way. Oh yes, look, the door is magically opened. Isn't that good? I'm sure there'll be like, you're currently playing on a modded Minecraft. Okay, you, I, I didn't know if you were still doing the modded Minecraft con clan or not because um, I think you started off doing the you start off doing like a, a series on it, and then um, is it still the same the same modded server that you was um, doing before? I I really should check Discord much. To to be honest, if I'm completely honest, I've not really been in like the Discord mind frame since um, I shut like the old my old server down, and I I mean I I check on there now and again, but um, yeah, I probably should. Check out this call a lot more. Hey, Andrews. I'm on the upper deck, but the corridor to the navcom is fucking better. Oh, damn it. Well, luckily the corridor is partitioned off, so the fire won't affect the rest of the ship. And luckily for you, there's only one way to get into the navcom room. And luckily is my fucking middle name. Get it out. You'll have to perform an EVA, extravehicular activity. Yeah, I know what an EVA is. And? Find the outer hatch into Navcom. Can you do it? I'm counting on you. Remember, you die. I uh, host a modded server. Me, Hanky, Elf, and yours oh, play on. Yeah. I create a mod pack. Aaron's also hosts a villa server, but I don't plan it. Yeah, I mean, I did. I did contemplate um, getting back into Minecraft a bit. I'd prepare for an EVA. Um, I'm not going that way. I've never really played like Minecraft with a group up like proper with a group of people before. I used to do uh tech it series and bits and pieces, but I was just kind of like always just on my own. That spacesuit looks weird. I think as well though when I think when you was doing yours I, I kind of tried to do um I did try and like install some modded Minecraft and I was just getting errors so I think I just gave up in the end Yeah okay well, that's, that's, you know that's cool especially if somebody's like spending a lot of time sort of like mining resources and stuff you know Maybe I'll come and join you Someday. All right. Oh, I have a little. I spent all that time mining the goddamn thing. Launch him into space. At least I've got a little chevron. I guess that's something.
Well, Tim says, great mod, mod in Minecraft because it keeps your mods and stuff separate. Also, if you have problems, it's usually problems with Jar. Yeah, I mean, I was using, um, I think at the time I was using the Technic launcher anyway. Which I don't think is particularly great. Are all these rocks just like orbiting the ship or what? That's what, that's what it feels like here. They're just going round and round. They are just literally orbiting the ship. Relief mod pack used to be on launcher, but find it much easier to just distribute into a jar. You can import that way; people can install it however they want with multi MC. There's just there. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know what you mean. I think that's the most guidance I've had from this game so far. World at War mapping tools. Yeah, I've, I think I've made a map in World at War before. I don't think it was very good. And I don't think the zombies spawned properly, but I made a map. <laughs> when I was at uni, I was always trying to get into... Um, use the Unreal Tournament editor. But I didn't properly understand about the whole kind of building blocks as walls and things, I just thought literally you drew a wall and I, I could, I, it took me ages to work out how to freaking place a block. It was crazy. Yeah, yeah. Do, do, do a lot of people still make maps in World of War, do you know, Conclan? I, I've not like looked at the um, zombie modding stuff for years now. Some people are coming up with some really good tools and some really good uh, maps for that, for sure. I thought I'd be so happy to get back inside this goddamn broken piece of shit. Oh, wish I would have done it. It was the first time I was in here. I don't think the... Because they, they, obviously they released um, the modding tools for Black Ops 3, but I don't think they really... I don't think, A, they really took off that much, and B... I don't think, um, I think people were, were just saying they just weren't as advanced. Not like, um, I'm sure like the, I'm sure the big like modding thing for World of War was like the UGX mods and stuff. All right, what was that? I'm like, hey, Andrews, it's Coop. I'm here, Coop. Sounds like you survived your spacewalk. Yeah, I'm in the NAVCOM. Ha <laughs> You're a fucking legend, mate. When we get home, yeah. I'll buy you a tank of beer. That's a promise. Can the bullshit and tell me what to do. Alright, I'll we'll role play that. This next bit is going to be a bit of a challenge. You should see four different sections. Navigation, route calculation, radar control, and transmission. You have to link them. Then use the radar control terminal. Scan the area and send the signal. It looks complicated, but it all makes sense when you think it through. You good? Sure. Can't be harder than lugging rocks around all day, right? Haha. <laughs> right. But now I need to check something. The pipes down here are making some noises that I don't really like the sounds of. Don't get into any trouble. <laughs> you know me. Yeah. That's the problem. So... These stolen machines still have power. We just need to figure out a connection sequence. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Easy. So I've got to connect. All you can basically tell me is I've got to connect all the terminals up. Nothing else. <sighs> Alright, I can't. 
can't even remember any of the freaking commands for this game. Because it's been over a week since I played. <sighs> okay. Um, that's not good. Station information not available. Alright, so that's not... Oh, actually, I wonder if I... Well, that's my freaking objective. This one has an error. So... I guess I'm going to need to fix this one. Don't know how. Because the game isn't going to tell me. So yeah, the basic, basically the, the difficulty is a little bit weird on this because the idea behind, or the, the developer's ideas behind the game. Someone's having me to be, Morse code. So yeah, the... Dot dash something. Oh, okay, so it's kind of like seep through a little bit. So the dot dash dash. So that's a dot dash dash. Okay, doesn't really mean too much. Yeah. So the the idea behind this is. Um, we are basically just like a, a like an average bloke who knows nothing about this. We're just a miner, and we do like we're, we're the chef on the side, and we're basically thrown in at the deep end, and we've got to try and work all of this out without any um, basically any prior knowledge. But what the developers have done is that they've literally just taken it to that extreme. Whereby there are literally very little hints in the game. And so far it's, it's not been too uncommon that we're just like literally walking around trying to randomly find stuff that will help us pro progress. I mean, we found the Morse code, right? Yes. Um, I mean, I was I was really drawn into it on the first instance because, um, to me, it had like a an alien isolation vibe, and I was like, I really love that game. Um, but like I said, I, I asked LB what he thought of the game and I think he'd seen somebody play it and he was like, yeah, it's, it's, it's not good, <laughs> which is a shame. And that is why I always normally conf confront, uh, consult LB before I purchase a game, but, uh, you win some, you lose some. All right. So there's nothing through here of great use. Can I go through this one? It's always locked. All right, so everything I, I'm going to, I assume, everything I need is in this room. So I've got to send a distress signal, but I've got a do something on all of this first, right? So that's not working. Can't use that one yet. So this is the only one that is working. Okay. So um, 
Oh, okay, so there was a... So we can ping radar I O V pub. Or not. So what other Uh, what other commands have I got? List machines and network. Connect. What did I do wrong? Come on, Cooper. You got this. So, what is my. What's my IP? Um, what is my IP? Connect to. Oh, hold on. Right, okay, I think I want to do. So let's now connect to. Go scripting up one nine two dot one six eight dot one dot twenty seven on ports ooh eighty <sighs> okay so we need to listen one nine two one six eight dot one dot twenty seven Connect. Let's try port eight four seven oh six. Port is opened. Excellent. So now I guess we need to do the same again, right? And we need to do the one nine one. So then it's Oh shit, what's the listen? One nine two one six eight one dot one nine one connect one nine two dot one six eight dot one dot one ninety one five zero six two four oh Five six zero two four. Ooh, okay, rest one. Point the chip rate off control. Okay, cool. We hacked it. So this is radar control, right? Let's try this. What? Okay. All right, so I need to look up my Morse code. I guess I just need to send SOS. So it's dot, 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 dash, 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 dot, dot, dot. Why do I not know that? Of course it is. So it's... Ooh. Okay, I, I got I got this. Waiting. Wait. 
rating. Alright, I think I'm missing something. Um, so... So we have all them codes on the right hand side, right? Can't use codes on the right though to the coordinates on there, right? So that doesn't make any sense. See, these terminals are still down. Let's just take a picture of that. Two seconds, guys. I will be right back. Apologies, guys. Wife's, uh, wife's a bit under the weather at the minute, and she wants some tablets. So, uh, right, let me take a picture of this. Let me take a picture of this. I mean, this is the um, this is the whole obscurity thing coming in right in here. Unless the numbers on this, maybe. I've had the freaking sweats for I don't know how long. Too freaking high in the UK. But we shouldn't grumble. We're always moaning that we're cold. Transmission unit. 
zero forty twenty three seven. I mean, I don't know if these do these numbers have some sort of record. I'm making note of these. Zero forty What the hell is going on? Okay. Did we manage to learn anything from that? I don't think so. Clearly it's going to be important though. For something. Um... Okay, so, do any of those numbers that we can see on that panel there have any correlation to here? I wrote 040-2372. Well, the only number I can see is the 0, which is CUL, but... If I what if I sent one of these codes, maybe C U L No, I didn't see it. U is L is Uh... 
Um, All right, so I'm definitely done with this because I can't use that again. That might be Morse code, but it's freaking fast for Morse code to try and decode that. That just sounds like static. That sounds like a 56k modem dialing up. It's on a loop. Got any ideas on this one, Conklin? Because I'm all out of freaking ideas. <laughs> no worries, buddy.
clearly I've got a I don't even know where I am. Hold on. Is there like a starting and ending Morse code? I wonder if there's like a special thing you have to. I didn't know if there was like a way to start a new line. SOS. Pretty sure I did it right, but well, that's not SOS, is it? The hell is this freaking? You only use by original messenger and only for an imminent danger to life or property. It says code, all right, well, hold on. It says code 05, right? 05 is CBA. All right, so where is my freaking, I need a Morse code picture here. All right, so this is code 05. So 05 is CBA. Okay, so is all I need to do? Maybe now I need to listen to this.
All right, let's not do anything different. So I've done that. But now what do I do? Talk of Andrews. Hey, engineering department, you there? Engineering reads you. Small pass department. Hydraulics are grinding to life. Sounds like you've succeeded. Sending the signal now. If anybody's out there, they'll hear us. We might still make it. You, me, Leah, Mitch. How about you? What's the status down there? I went to check out that sound that was bothering me. Yeah, you told me. Is this going to be a long story? It was a cooling pipe. Dry as a desert. The fuck does that mean? Get to the point, man. Jesus, man. This ship is getting to you. Or maybe you were always just as big an asshole. I'm, I'm just sick of taking orders from an intercom while you sit on your ass. You think that that's all I'm goddamn doing? Jesus, man, give it a rest. The dry pipes mean that there's no coolant going into the reactor. It's got to be burning up right now. You need to get to the machinery and fix this. If the reactor melts, this whole ship's going to go supernova. A rescue team would just find atoms by the time they get here. There it is, my next air head. You need to machinery then. Just redirect the coolant. Simple. Sure. Oh yeah, Keep simple. Out. Okay. Oh look at that. The door magically opens for me now. Apart from the fact I can't get around. One of these slow, creaky old frickin' elevators, man. Okay. This machinery. Uh, okay. Well, that can't be good. Running water like that. Guess we're going to go around here. Jesus, I can't even hear myself bloody thinking here. What the hell am I supposed to do? Well, we need to redirect the coolant, clearly. Alright, so we can't climb up the ladder. That don't sound good. Nobody talking on the intercom. Aha. This must be the redirections command. Right. Two, 
Are you kidding me? I got red goes to blue, blue goes to white, and that was about it. So where does red go to blue? Maybe we need to go up here. This is tedious. Uh, uh, Blue goes to red, red goes to white, yeah. So that's the first bit. But now I can't. Jeez. Do I have to do something else? The action for this is terrible. I have to pick my mouse up and drag my mouse to rotate it. Okay, so maybe I need to do all of this side first. Alright, that one's done. So, I do know next one is... Should be this one, and we've got to turn it counterclockwise. Ah, uh, now I don't remember the next bit. Maybe I go back to the control room now, possibly. Maybe. I think it's pretty dumb that it doesn't allow you to like go back over the instructions.
Oh. Come on, I'll do the other one first. Maybe it's just me being dumb. Wouldn't be a first the first time. But yeah, I mean it's just like the the objective is just redirect the coolant. There's no no further information on that at all. Oh, there's no valve on this side. Valve! Alright, find comm system in the area. Uh plan. This goddamn place is well and truly fucked. Find an alternative way to get out. Oh shit. I don't know what Andrews is up to, man. He's very he's he's being very, very sneaky. As if by magic the door now opens. So now I've got to freaking go around in a maze. Oh man. Uh, bathroom. I did wonder if this hatch actually opened or not. Door over here must open. What's beeping exactly? This kind of like looks like a carbon copy of another area. Is that a door? That kind of looks like it's meant to be a door. That's just protruding through the wall. Maybe wrong. But doesn't look so good. Alright, doesn't look like there's anything in here for me to interact in with. Let's head over here. Uh, 
Um, well, that looks safe. As does that. Where is that water actually coming from? Hmm. Alright. Kind of like, 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 like a geezer or a hot spring. Would you know it? We found one. Andrews, Andrews, you there? Hello. Typical. Right when you start to really like a guy, he stops returning your calls. Cooper, I can hear you, mate. But we've got a big. Wow, that's well, subtitles are way wrong there. Jeez. The goddamn reactor core is melting. The coolant that you sent in vaporized too quickly, and the shell finally blew. She's getting hotter and hotter, and she won't stop until she blows. The only thing holding us together right now is a battery backup. Cooper, you have to shut that thing down before it blows, or there isn't even going to be enough of us left to mail home. Fucking hell, why are we still talking? Alright, that's that's not good. That sounds like a, an alarm of some description. So yeah, that's that's never good. I think. Well, I've noticed that in a few it's like just like I've been there for like a few typos and a few like wrong words and stuff, which is, you know. Fair enough, you know, it's, uh, I'm, I'm not normally the grammar police, but um, the fact that they got completely the wrong character there was, um, yeah. Looks like we're going this way. Radiation hazard. Fucking radiation. That's just what I do today. Not enough that I'm about to blow up. I also need... You'd hope so. This is like freaking infra all over again, man. Dealing with the fucking reactors. What the hell? Sure we do. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Jesus, this thing is massive. Got to keep moving before I cook like a fucking baked potato. So what have I got to do? Just wander around and work it out again, randomly. I guess. Let's turn over to this room. Alright. We have more errors. Terminal I can use. Just the one though. All right, let's check out the terminal. This terminal has to have a sequence to shut this thirsty bitch down. God damn it! What is this system? Um, heat shield temperature is two thousand two hundred thirty-seven C. That's pretty hot. Okay. Alright, is this like a freaking game? 
So what have we actually got to do? One A, two B, three D, four C. Okay, so column number. So RH column number times three point five. The energy calculation formula is PE, so the produced energy equals the previous cell energy plus the row number times the column number. And then the rod calculation formula is the produced energy What? divided by the column number times 3.5. Great <sighs> size is critical. Exit pressure is 1886. Yeah, maths. Maths. We're doing maths. We're not doing math. We're doing maths. English stream, Conclan. It's maths. <laughs> um... I, I, I have no idea what I'm meant to be doing. I set them all to one. Jif. What's, no, it's not a GIF, it's a GIF. G, 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 GIF. Um. There must be something somewhere that tells me about pressures. I mean, like... I must have missed something. Right? <laughs> yeah, um, Mixer isn't, um, Mixer hasn't been, um, well known for its, um, emotes to date. Okay. What on earth am I meant to be doing here? Well doesn't look like I'm getting any help from any of the information here. There's no like, there's not there's like any calculations or anything like that that I could use that are going to be helpful. Pay attention for airflow. Um, I 
How do I know what the previous cell energy is, though? So I need to... If there is no... Ah, okay. So if there's no previous cell, PCE equals 1. So... Okay, 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 okay. So... Um, 1... But we need to do the row number times... Because it's bod mass, so it's... Row times column. What is... What is... Eight? 1 times 1... Plus 1 equals 2. That's what I'm going for. Or is it 5? Would you say 8? Would you say it's row... Would you say it's column 1 or column 5, Conclan? Maybe it's 5. So 1 times 5 is 5, plus 1 is 6. Um... 2 times 4 is 8, plus 6 is 14. Three times two is six. Six plus fourteen is twenty. Uh, three times four is twelve. So it's thirty-two. And one times five is five. That'd be thirty-seven. All right, so now I need to move on to rod calculation. It's PE, which is the produced energy, uh, divided by the row number. No, sorry, the column number times three. <sighs> Brackets of division first. Division first. So, no, it's called... All right, so 1A So that's column number 5 times 3 and a half 5 times 3.5 So that's 17.5 And then I want to do the PE, so 6 divided by 17.5 equals 0 0.34289. 0 maybe 9. 2B. So I need to do all of these I need to do all these calculations first. This this is this is a bit dumb, personally. Um two B. So what am I doing again? Rod calculation is column number, so it's four. Four times three point five. That's fourteen. So fourteen Divided by 14 is 1. Why well, don't I even need to calculate for that? Okay, 3D. So again, row number. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, no, column number. <laughs> so 2 times 3.5 equals 7. 20 divided by 7 equals. 2.8571 for C. 3.5 times 3. 10.5. 32 divided by 10.5 equals. 3.0476 Last one 
5e. 3.5 times 1. 3.5. 37 divided by 3.5 equals 10.571. Calculate wrong. So what did I do wrong? Other than my calculation. <sighs> Alright, there's no previous cell... PCE equals one. See, the other way is one plus one times five equals ten. So that could be ten. All right. Let's go with columns the other way around then. 2 plus 2 is 4. 4 times... Oh no. 10 plus... 2 times 2. 14. I'm so confused. Oh, wait a second though. Are we... Maybe I need to just substitute the letter. So maybe E is 5 because it's the fifth letter of the alphabet possibly. Alright, so... 10... Row number times column number, so 1 times 1 equals 1, of course, plus 1 equals 2. Okay, next one. 2 times 2 plus 2, 6. Uh, then we've got 6 times... Oh, what am I doing? No! Bod mass not. Bod mass. 2 times 2 is 4. 4 plus 2 is 6. Well, I did that right. Where am I? Oh, I don't know. 3 times 4 is 12 plus 6 is 18. Um, 3 times 4 is 12 that would be 30 and then 5 times 5 is 25 so that would be 55 if those calculations are correct so then we want to do Column number says so one times three point five divided by two one point seven five. Are you sticking with me? Are you sticking with me? I really freaking hope so. So then we got two times three point five seven six divided by seven one. Point zero point eight five seven one three point five times by three ten point five eighteen divided by ten point five one point seven one four two Four C three point five times four. It's 
14. 30 divided by 14. 2.1428. 5e. 3.5 times 5, 17 and a half. 55 divided by 17.5. It's pi. 3.1428. Um, let me just recheck one. 18 divided by Okay. Let's have a quick glimpse. Look at all the information on screen. A is not one or five. Okay. It's not one or five. Then what is it? Anybody see anything that I don't see? I don't want to go down too much further, to be honest. I don't want to spoil it. Am I missing?
Developer just says it's on the reactor terminal. Oh, are you? I think. Okay. One. So A would be two. On a QWERTY keyboard, I reckon the colors here have something to do with it. Developer says on the terminal, keep focus, right? So it's one, two, three, four, five. So. A is 2, B is 5, C is 4, D is 4, and E would be four as well. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. B might be seven. But is it just the green keys? That would be a bit too elaborate, surely. gonna have a look um says I finally got it we were on the right track after all must have just miscalculated or didn't have enough places or something Blow us some hints, but no answers. Okay. Energy will be whole numbers. Rod heights will be decimal. Well, yeah, I, I gather that anyway. Energy is always under 100. Well, not anyway. Rod height is always under 5.
So they're saying they're saying A is one. After all the reading that entire thread of them saying no no it's not one, not five, they're saying it's one. So one times one is one plus one is two. Two times two is four plus two is six. Three times four is twelve plus six is eighteen. Four times three is twelve plus eighteen is twenty is thirty. Five times five is twenty five plus thirty is fifty five. Which is what I got. So then we got 3.5, 2 divided by 3.5. Right, so that needs to be 0.5714. 2B, 3.5 times by a uh, column number. Two, seven, six divided by seven. That's what I got. Three point five times four is fourteen. Eighteen divided by fourteen, one point two eight five seven. Which would have got three point five times three, ten point five thirty divided by ten point five, two point eight. Okay, 2.8571.8571 and then here we've got 3.5 times 5, 17.5, 3.1428. My brain hurts. All right, I did the wrong calculation on a couple of those. The temperature is coming down. I have been and always shall be your... God damn it. Seriously? I was having a moment over here. Okay. Did the door just lock on me? Am I being shafted here? More than likely. There we go. Okay. But not glowing, so it did the job. Injuries. Uh, hello. Anybody home? He got wasted. Uh, 
Andrews, that you? You're fine. Keep up, Dad. Hallelujah. How did you find me? Found some bloody footprints. <laughs> Joking, man. Ah, oh, yeah. Good one. You've got a weird sense of humor. I, I saw the captain. He was. He was him. Was him. A man. I know, man. The pipe did a number on him. It was terrible. You get me out of here, though. I'll take care of his body. Give him a proper send off. Damn door slammed behind me and trapped me in here. Sure. I look yeah, um... to you face to face. Can you see the panel in front of you? Looks like the one from the kitchen. Similar. This time, open it up and turn the lever to the right. I think. I think I would like to like arm myself. I have a feeling this dude has been like killing off the crew. Shock horror. I want to shoot you. I fucking knew it. You don't know goddamn. It. But you know what? I'm convinced you to change my mind. Get out of here and make it easy on both of us. The toilet bodies. Me and Mitch. Lying in their own blood. Right next to your fucking dog tags. You son of a bitch. All right. So now all of a sudden, it's turned into a freaking. Get out here and make this easy on both of us. Toilet bodies. Me and Mitch, lying in their own blood, right next to your fucking dog tags. You son of a bitch. Really wasn't supposed to go down like this. Fucking hell, man. Why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. I'll keep this fucking tin can running all day. Forced to use these piece of shit outside of terminals. On call 24-7. Hey, Andrews, my door's stuck. Hey, Andrews, the reactor's about to supernova and kill everybody. Hey, Andrews, my printer fucking jammed. I was a soldier. I was suspected. A fucking matter. Then I get stripped of my rank and tossed out on my ass. And for what? For some drugs? Oh, but hypermorphine is free in the cafeteria. Everybody gets to use that so they can control us. Mindless, I'm feeling what super soldier. Doing? Ready to do bidding on the top brass. But I get kicked out for signing fucking on Obviously not that. Holy shit. <sighs> All right. Make this easy on both of us. So the bodies. Me and Mitch. Oh. I, it's just gone from like puzzle game now to like something's completely different. So the bodies. Me and Mitch. Lying in their own blood. Right next to your fucking dog tags. You son of a bitch. How did he freaking see me there? What a joke! A joke! So the bodies, me and Mitch, lying in their own blood, right next to your fucking dog tags, you son of a bitch. Hell, man. Why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. I'll keep this fucking tin can running all day. Forced to use these pieces to get outside of terminals. What am I meant to do? Hey, Andrews, my door's stuck. Hey, Andrews, the reactor's about to supernova. Hey, Andrews, my printer's back. Oh, my God. Bodies, me and Mitch, 
Lying in their own blood, right next to your fucking dog tags, you son of a bitch. Oh, why was around the freaking corner? All right, this is just this is frustrating now. I don't even know where I'm meant to be freaking starting this evac procedure from. In here, the reactor's about to supernova and kill everyone. I can't just like lock him in there. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm meant to be doing. Saw their bodies, Lee and Mitch, lying in their own blood, right next to your fucking dog tags, you son of a bitch. Man, why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. I keep this fucking tin can running all day. Forced to use this piece of shit outside its terminal. Where the hell am I meant to do this? Oh, for <sighs> any ideas? <sighs> start the evacuation. How do we start the evacuation? Go home and have a cry. Yeah, that's, uh, I like the sound of that. And of course, there's not really anything on here. How to start evac on I don't want to freaking react to walkthrough. I just want to find out how to do the freaking evac procedure. All right. Let him out. It's right at the end of the game as well. Go around there, go around there. Oh, that's dumb. That's dumb. Saw their bodies. Lee and Mitch lying in their own blood. Right next to your fucking dog tags. Son of a bitch. Damn it. No, he saw me. All right. There we go. But I, I was right when I was hiding out in here. Get out here and 
and make this easy on both of us. It's all their bodies. Lee and Mitch, lying in their own blood, right next to your fucking dog tags, you son of a bitch. Oh, man, why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. I'll keep this fucking tin can running all day. Alright, he's gone that way. I need to get in the room. Basically. Hey, Andrews, my door's stuck. Hey, Andrews, the reactor's about to supernova and kill everybody. Hey, Andrews, my printer fucking jammed. I was a soldier. I was suspected. A fucking magic. Then I'll get stripped of my rank and tossed out on my ass. And for what? No, he was over there. I think he's just on a freaking pattern. I've just got to freaking be patient. It's all their bodies. Me and Mitch, lying in their own blood. Right next to your fucking dog tags, you son of a bitch. Damn it. I really did hope you could get there in time to help them. It really wasn't supposed to go down like this. Fucking hell, man. Why did you do it? I just wanted a little What's the pot ID? Shit. I'll keep this fucking tin can of course, now I need to freaking find something on the floor. <sighs> Wouldn't be that simple, would it? Get out here and make this easy on both of us. It's all their bodies. Lee and Mitch, lying in their own blood, right next to your fucking dog tags, you son of a bitch. Damn it. I really did hope you could get there in time to help them. It really wasn't supposed to go down like this. Fucking hell, man. Why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. <sighs> I can't even make out what it says on the freaking floor. 2L7GE. Right. Get out here and make this easy on both of us. Oh my goodness. Get out here and make this easy on both of us. So the bodies. Lee and Mitch lying in their own blood. Right next to your fucking dog tags, you son of a bitch. I really did hope you could get down. What was that code again? Can you remember Conclan? I've already forgotten it. I can't bother to go look. Two L seven. Two L seven GE. To help them, it really wasn't supposed to go down like this. Fucking hell, man. Why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. I'll keep this fucking tin can running all day. Forced to use these piece of shit outdated terminals. It's called 20. Oh, uh. hey, Andrews, my door's stuck. Hey, Andrews, the reactor's about to supernova and kill everybody. Hey, Andrews, my printer fucking jammed. I was a soldier. I was suspected. A fucking magic. Then I get stripped of my right. <sighs> 2L7GE. Oh, come on. <laughs> this bit's stupid. This bit of the game is stupid. Change my mind. Get out here and make this easy on both of us. It's all their bodies. <sighs> Saw their bodies. Lee and Mitch lying in their own blood. Right next to your fucking dog tags. You son of a bitch. Damn it. I really did hope you could get there in time to help them. It really wasn't supposed to go down like this. Fucking hell, man. Why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. I'll keep this fucking tin can running all day. Why did they fucking shoot me straight away? What the hell?
changed my mind. Get out here and make this easy on both of us. It's all their bodies. Me and Mitch, lying in their own blood. Right next to your fucking dog tags. You son of a bitch. Oh, fuck. And where was he? You don't get enough time to react, I don't think, personally. Fucking hell, man. Why did you do it? I just wanted a little goddamn respect. I'll keep this fucking tin can running all day. Both to you can keep it. Get out there and tell me. Two L seven G eight. Oh, I've got to... Do I now have to wait around? What's this guy doing on here? Looks like we have to literally <sighs> Yep, we have to do that first and then we have to stand around and evade him. Can I please move? We were like brothers. Can I, can I hide out here? When the leftover skeleton crew couldn't fix the damage, I'd swoop in and save everybody at the last moment. I'd be a hero. People would finally realize how much I do. I 
I did what I had to do. But I didn't realize the captain had set the doors in the area to go to a security lockdown. When you re-sparked the power, the door slammed and I found myself trapped on the other side. So I had to get you up here to let me out. Which, apologies, is awkward. It would have been much better for me to get the hell out of here and leave you running stupid errands in the bowels of the ship. Unaware of what was about to happen. You're just gonna leave me up here, Andrews. Andrews, I've got a wife. She's pregnant, man. Are you really that heartless? Fuck, man. Don't take it out on me that nobody will ever love you. Do you ever shut up? I'm gonna hear your voice. I'm out of here. I've had enough. Jeez, just hide out. Cooper? Cooper! Hack this motherfucker. Where's my e back? Fuck. Okay. So, where do I start? Where do I start? So, unfortunately, I don't think this game is worth the money I paid for it. I think I paid about... I bought it on the day it came out, and I paid about... I think I paid about £20. It's not worth £20. The puzzles and the actual sort of gameplay and, and what you're meant to do is very cryptive. There is, there is no... There is no guidance from the majority of the game as to what you're meant to do, where you're meant to go. Um, and the game is purposely designed like that because of the fact that we're playing this character who is a minor and has no um, technology kind of background or anything. But there are better ways to do it than this, unfortunately. Um... As for the that whole end sequence, yeah, we knew Andrews was like screwing us over and he was crooked, but that whole end sequence was just so frustrating. Really, really, really frustrating. And it really did not... To, personally, it could have played out a, a totally different and there was no need for some dude running around chasing us, one-shotting us right at the end of the game there. It just seems stupid. Completely and utterly stupid. Uh, and it's a shame. I was really looking forward to playing this game. I thought when it first came out, it was a really nice looking game. I had Alien Isolation Valves. Uh, valves. Alien Isolation Vibes from the game. Um, and unfortunately, it was um, pretty disappointing, to say the least. Um, and yeah, there is nothing more there. I mean, so, so, the, the puzzles weren't even... The, the puzzles weren't hard. The puzzles were just lengthy because it was there. Were, there was so little information to given to you on how to solve them. <sighs> yeah, fortunately, very very disappointed. But guys, thank you very much for tuning in. As always, thanks for on screen. We'll be back tomorrow night. I'm streaming something different. But until then, I've been knock. You've been awesome. See ya.